I'm wanting to dance already. It's a beloved musical that has stood the test of time. Fiddler on the Roof is back with a whole new production now playing at the Straz. And today I am joined by two of the stars. Me, you're probably lacking sleep a little bit because of course you were on stage <laughs> last night. But thank you for joining yeah. us today. Sure, sure. Thank you for inviting. So let's let's dive in. Fiddler on the Roof. Some people think, oh, so emotional yet joyous. Explain Fiddler on the Roof and why it does tug at so many emotions in case you haven't been able to see it for yourself yet. You mean the storyline? Yes. Yeah, well, it's a story about um, our family. We have five daughters, and we need to get them married. Um, and they seem to not agree with the plans that we have for them, so they uh, defy tradition. And then we also seem to be defying the Russian community that is living around us in the Pale of Settlement. Um, well, the story takes place in 1905, mm -hmm. Anatevka, which is a fictional shtetl. Um, and then he also adds another layer uh, to the show with his relationship with, with God. Let's talk a little bit about the different relationships, because some humor almost is brought in with your relationship with God, as you are a, a, the patriarch of the family, trying to stay loyal to those traditions that you're able to see. Even though this took place so many years ago and the scene was so different, there are still ways today that I feel like you hear older generations say, oh, well, back in my day. Like, it's a story that even though it happened so long ago, there still can be some parallels in today's world between generations. Would you think? Well, I think, it, I, I think tradition is something that will stay forever. Mm -hmm. I think it's something, and, and, and it's uh, what the show is all about. I think it's the balance. And uh, tradition, it's very important that we will take it on the right, you know, the right way, because tradition can be very, uh, very bad, you know, and mm -hmm. there can be some s beautiful stuff in that, and beautiful s things that are keeping the community, beautiful things that keeps um, the family, and beautiful things that keeps, you know, you and yourself, you know. Uh, uh, for example, I'm, um, I'm coming from a religious family, and I know that there are things that I kept just to feel the roots, just to feel that I'm not so far. People asking me why you eat kosher, you know, why you don't, mm -hmm. why you don't eat, uh, and it's just not because of my belief in God. It's 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 just to be connected to my roots, and I think it's something that uh, will stay forever, you know. I think one way that people do connect so much with Fiddler on the Roof, no matter their background, is the music. Mm -hmm. is the dancing. Uh, yes. There are some fabulous nice. songs. We were talking Sunrise, Sunset, Matchmaker. I mean, it's I can hits. just... It's a hit after they hit. They are yeah. hit after hit. Yeah. Talk about it, actors being able to go and, and do these classics, perform these classics that I know people have got to be singing along with you. It's, it's just, we're so lucky to have, you know, we are so lucky to have, first of all, those roles are just written perfectly. The script mm -hmm. is amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, so many jokes, so many, you know, it's just perfectly written and then the songs it's just like unbelievable that we have the chance to to sing those beautiful songs and, and you can tell that the audience is singing with you it's not only the song they know the text by heart yes at Some the beginning before i'm saying a filler yeah. on the roof you know and i'm yes. coming uh, uh, the uh, you know the, they're shouting tradition before i'm starting oh, to. Yeah. that's amazing yeah, so that's gotta be so fun day in a it's day like yeah. a rock <laughs> you know? yeah, Sometimes like I'm going on stage and they're clapping their hands already, you know, because ah. they know what's going to happen. And it's and they're still crying, laughing like crazy and, you know, give us so much love. And that's that's incredible. Thank you to the both of you.